Today, we're gonna talk about an awesome little movie you probably didn't see, The Death of Stalin. It is directed by Armando Lanucci. It came out in 2017 in the United States and the UK, and 2018 in France. The plot to this is very simple. Stalin dies and his committee needs to figure out what they're going to do next. First, let's start with what I didn't like about this movie. And luckily, there's only two things. One, because it's a comedy, the camera work and cinematography is nothing great. It's not bad or anything, it's just not really interesting. Two, the color grade is kind of ugly. That's it. Everything else about this movie is awesome. Now on to the good. This movie is really funny. All the comedy is super dark and delivered in a very matter of fact manner. It's interesting how they turn such a huge event into a farcical comedy. I love the touch that everyone in the country is afraid of Stalin, even the people in his own committee. And this movie was made by the same people who made The Thick of It and the sequel movie In The Loop, which I absolutely loved. Everyone in this movie is great, especially Jeffrey Tambor, but the standout is easily Steve Buscemi. The man is amazing and it's always great to see him in movies. Final thoughts. This film does a great job balancing between when it gets really serious and when it's silly. If you liked In the Thick or In the Loop or even Veep, I believe they made this as well, you're going to enjoy this. It has a very similar tone, similar themes, which is basically people in high positions of power acting like idiots. If you enjoyed those, you're gonna enjoy this. And I found myself laughing through most of this movie. And like I said before, all the performances are great, especially Steve Buscemi and Jeffrey Tambor. They steal every scene they're in. As always, my name is Devarier Williams. Thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe and keep on watching movies, keep on watching anime, and keep on doing you. All right, bye-bye.